What's going on guys and welcome back to the green screen. Yeah, okay, I'm in Miami. Yeah, green screen. Uh, anyway, I had this amazing video idea. I don't think it's been done before, or at least not in this fashion, but I am going to be looking for JDM cars on Google Maps at really cool places like HKS, B Racing, Beer, whatever you want to call it. We're going to just try to find JDM cars. So I found eight destinations. If you guys want to see more of this, hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe. Let me know in the comment section that you want to see more and I'll do a part two of this video. So kicking it off, we're going to go to the UK, an area called Wingate. There's a place called the GTR shop. I believe they changed their name recently to the GTR Heritage something. Heritage Museum, I think. Now this place, they've got two top secret vehicles. They've got a 33 top secret and they've got a R35 top secret. Mind blowing, like the original ones, you know, the gold ones. So we're just gonna head down the road here and let's see what we find, okay. That's not even JDM, come on. I have vetted these just by the way. So I'm not wasting my time with the video. But look what we've got here. Sneaky 34 right there. Don't know what that is. I think it might be another 34. Is it? It's 32. And that, I don't know. And there's, there's something else. I mean, that looks just as bad as my 33 sitting in the driveway. There's a nice 33 over here. I think it could be a Sabon front bumper. It's got, uh, sorry, uh, bonnet. Front bumper is the same as mine on my GTR. And he's got a 33 sitting here, but I'm pretty sure these are all customer cars. They do, they do work. Um, I believe they've got a dyno here. They, they do engine rebuilds. They do all sorts. Another 33 in there. 34. There's a shell of some sorts here. What is that? Is that a 34? I think that's a 33. There's a 32. I mean, this place is just littered with GTRs. That is a 32. This one's a little bit screwed. And what's down the road? A truck. Or Bucky, if you're from South Africa. Boring, boring, boring. Okay, so our first one, some decent JDM. Oh, here we go. GTR shop, Japanese car specialist. So now they're the GTR Heritage Center or Museum, I forget. Moving on, we're gonna find Jap performance parts. And they are also in the UK. Look at that. What do you see straight away? Boom. WRX STI. I think this might just be a WRX and not an STI. But uh, either way, it's cool. It's a nice GC8. What we got over here? We got a Blob Eye, we've got a Forester, we've got a Hawkeye, and then I think it's a Mercedes and a BMW. I see a Snatch. I see a GTR, R35 though. So this is Jap Performance Parts in the UK. I think they're just, they're part strippers if I'm not mistaken. Ooh, I didn't see that earlier. Is that a Sylvia? No, it's a D4, the wing threw me off. Something, something sneaky over here. <clears throat> I don't know what that is in the back, that little white one. Tell me what you guys think that is. So the 34, there's some more Subarus. Hawkeye, Hawkeye, WRX, Hawkeye, STI. I like to take a look across the road. You know, there might be overflow parking or, I don't know how far down I'll go, but, ah, you see. What's that? Another Subaru, that looks like a blob eye. Yep, it's a good old blob. Time attack. Nice. What's that? What else is down here? Jag, BM. There's a Civic. Not a Type R though. So we're looking good. We found some decent cars. Hey! Miata. Hello. <laughs> Look how tiny it is next to these two cars. What is this? A Vauxhall? Vauxhall Insignia. Alright. There's a Civic for you boys. All your Honda guys. My favorite here is, is this. Gotta be that. Looks like a version three, maybe version four. And then there's obviously that 34 chilling over here. I think, 
Yeah, obviously it's more expensive, but I think I'll probably take the GC8. I really, really, really must them. I'll say this almost every. Next up, we're gonna jump all the way across the pond to Japan Partner in Nagoya. This is the place where I picked up both my RX-7s from. Well, they at least did the import, uh, exporting from Japan for me. They're based in Nagoya. They've got a 1.6 star review. I didn't go take a look. Apparently someone was um, impersonating and just trying to bring down their name. Uh, I kind of don't see anything other than that. And this dude with a cigarette, he's like royally confused. Check, he's even got a mask. I wonder if this was recent. Or was it just Japan with the masks? Okay, am I going in the right direction? It must be, I see. I see a type R. Ow, oh, what is that? <laughs> I see a type R. This is a legit type R. Check, it's even got an exhaust. I see something. Oh, that looks like a hatchback Subaru. See, they do parts as well. Parts stripping and all that. There's a... I was going to say Pajero, it's a Harlux Surf, I've never seen one of those. So check this out, a little bit further down the road, this is their outdoor lot, and I believe my car was sitting out in, in this lot. Or my cars. But look here, there's a 32. There's a 33, that looks like a Forester, Supra. Camry. Supra. 34. That's mad. This is, this is where they come from, guys. This is their home. Look at that. Look at that beauty. Mm. Old GF8 wagon. I can't get any closer. But if you look at my little, little dude over here, there's no, there's no other road. What a pity. And now we're going to shoot back to South Africa. I was going to do NX Gen, but I couldn't find anything on Google Maps. Maybe I just didn't look hard enough, but I saw something at Rob Green Motorsport. Rob Green is situated in Joburg somewhere. Uh, Straden Park, Randburg. I have been there like years and years and years ago. So they've got their famous RGM uh, supercharged 86. Actually got the power rating on the side somewhere. There we go. 220 kilowatts, 315 newton I remember that from the speed and the sound. And then there is this S2000. Doesn't that look sick? That is cool. Love one. Love one in yellow, just like this. Anyway, that's that. There's no other JDM cars here whatsoever. So moving on to 326 power in Hiroshima. Now these are tuners. They part suppliers and tuners. Uh, I, I see it here. Check this out. Look at that. How cool are these? Some 86s. GTRs for you badge boys. Audis. If you don't know what badge is. It's a VW Audi Golf. I had to think about that one. But anyway, we didn't come here for that crap. Look at this. How epic is this? Achiroko 86 that is so JDM Moving on to the final three this place called Karuma imports and it's in the United States and uh, I'm su actually honestly surprised that the, the Google Truck van whatever drove right in so okay, so look at this here's here's the road and then it kind of goes into here. This looks like private property. So there's a Chrysler Neon. So you wouldn't think there's anything else in here, right? I mean, you don't see anything else. Let's take a quick drive around the corner. I bet the guy was like, oh, let me do a U-turn. And then he's like, what is that? And he drove a little bit further. And he's like, holy shit, that's a 33. And that's a Midnight Purple 33 with an HK Super Power Flow exhaust. And then he's like, Oh my god, this is this in heaven. Yeah, that's cool. Another 33 right there, and then a Supra, and then there, 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 there. Let's see if there's anything in here. 
see something in there? Oh, silly Google camera. Anyway, this is uh, Karuma Imports They're in the United States. And then moving on to our final two. This one's in Chiba, Japan. Look at that. Top secret. How cool is their logo? I love this. I love this shit. Street and racing performance. Gritty. And then, look at that. Ooh, top secret 34. Lexus GS300. R32 GTR. R33 GTR. I'm not sure GTR. Doors are closed. What's here? This, this, this. What is that thing? Something Pajero. Anyway, this is top secret. I think we might be able to get a view from the side. Can we see anything from here? Nope. What do you think? What's that? A Prius. That's a pity. Anyway, that's top secret. I'd love to walk into these places and just pick up the camera and vlog. One day. You guys are going to get me there. Because I'll get you the content. You can live vicariously through me. Finding JDM shit. What's that? <laughs> it's a Honda something. It's got two doors. And it's small. There's a micro. And then finally, we cannot forget to hit up the boys at Garage Defend in the United States. You can see this is going to be good already. Tamai. Maybe we'll look at Tamai Endless in the next, next video. If you guys want a part two of this. Look at this baby. 34, 34, non-GTR. Still cool. Still cool, my friends. Non-GTRs. I wonder if they park the non-GTR like the cheapies around the corner. S15 Silvia, S15 Silvia with the aero kit on it. 33 GTR. This looks like a one-way. Garage Defend. I dig their logo. I mean, we've seen these videos with your car, bro, and you know, all the, the cool US guys that were stationed in, uh, where were they stationed again? In that island, Okinawa. They all moved back to the States, so lacking a little bit of content. Look at that animal. 34, 34, Sylvia. I, mean, I think this is probably by far the best in terms of what we've been able to see. But it's been cool seeing some of the others too. I dig this. ST205, such an underrated vehicle and good, good value for money. It's got a 3S GTE in it, 2 litre turbo, another 34 GTR, another S15 Sylvia. Holy shit. Imagine waking up, like you wake up in the morning, you're like, oh, let me just get up for some GTRs and JDM cars. You would never be like, oh, do I really have to go to work? This would be cool. Anyway, that is it for the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you want a part two, just remember, smash that like button. Make sure you subscribe, drop a comment, and I'll do a part two in the weeks to come. Let me know. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.